We are on our way home from the Dollar Tree. Just went to the Dollar Tree and can you guys see? Oh, my hand was in the way. Um, bags. Oh no, where's the other bags? Oh. Oops. Wait. Here's a bag right there. So right when I get home, I will show you guys what I bought. And I bought some stuff to bring to Miami. Really cute things. I hope you like them. And I hope it gives you guys some ideas of what to get. This is the hat from the Dollar Tree too. I think it's cute. But you're not going to believe what I got. It's really good. Better than I expected. I've never seen them before there. So we'll... I'll post it in a minute. Okay, bye. Okay, I'm gonna set you up here. Hi everyone, and welcome to my channel. So, I'm getting ready for my trip. Um, we leave in 11 days. Let's see, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, Saturday, Sunday, Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, Saturday. Three, 10 days. We leave in 10 days, so I'm getting things um, for our trip. And I went to the Dollar Tree, and I'm so excited. I found some super good things. And this is the hat from Dollar Tree. I really like it. It's, it's wide, so I have a bigger head, so it doesn't squish my head. Anyway, let's jump right into it. It's not all for the trip, but you're, you'll see. So I'll start off with the essentials so I bought these for the airplane so I can clean the tray off and the seats and the armrests good and clean remember when these were so hard to find let's smell them mmm lemony they smell clean lemon scented kills 99.9% .9 of bacteria in 15 seconds not 14 but 15 okay what else Oh, so I bought some, so we have hard water here. I don't, I don't have a water softener. We have a well, but this, this is that awesome rust lime calcium. So I'm hope, hoping that'll get the toilets cleaned underneath the rim. And I also use a pumice stone, which I ordered from Amazon. Um, that works really well too, but I don't, I don't like to use that all the time. But this, I will let you know if it works. I don't know if this is new or not. So it's new formula, all-purpose cleaner, um, rust lime calcium, chalk. So there you go. And then this I use for my countertops and my bathroom countertops. And now instead of just the cap, it has a spray. So I thought that was really awesome for this awesome cleaner. I think this used to be a commercial, you know, one of those uh, commercials in the middle of the night when you can't sleep and they did like car tires and cleaned everything. I think this was like that. I might be wrong. If you guys know what I'm talking about, comment down below and set me straight. Oh my God, the cat's on the, I have to show you what's happening here. She had to sit there. Really, she saw that I was digging into the bag. Let's see. Oh, don't move. No, heavens, don't move. We're only doing a show here. Okay. Then, my son's still itchy, so we got him this body wash, ultra moisturizing, shea butter, and cocoa. So let's smell that. It's a big size. Mmm. It smells like cocoa, kind of sweet. It says, enriched with nourishing oils, ultra moisturizing, shea and cocoa butter. Mmm, it smells really nice. Not too feminine either. So that's that. Okay. So I think, I think, I don't know if she's sitting in. Are you sitting in? Okay, you can sit in it. I don't care. She's happy. And then I'm on the keto diet and I found this strawberry watermelon healthy balance juice. 
And I thought it says diet on it. It has one gram of sugar and two net grams of carbs, so six calories. Yeah. So it's strawberry watermelon. I think that'll be good with like a cocktail, maybe vodka and a little a couple limes squeezed in. And then, because I haven't been able to have like um, orange juice and vodka, what do you call those? In the morning, screwdriver. I found that, the diet one. So it is mango and tangerine, and I bet you this would be really good for a morning drink. <clears throat> Because sometimes you just need to relax. Let's see, the lighting is a little bright. Is that better? Yeah. And then it brightens up. And we have a fireplace downstairs that go. We have two wood stoves, one here, right there, and then another one downstairs. So. I only got more than this. Oh, wow. I got a lot. And then I have these. These are my favorite snack. I like to dip these in hummus. These, of course, are the plain pork rinds. So I've seen on keto shows, you can even grind these up and use it as a flour base for pan keto pancakes and keto other keto baked things. I haven't tried that yet. Okay, and then, I'm gonna save that. I got another one of these to light my candles. These are so convenient. I'm tired of using this the cigarette lighter and burning my thumbnail off. So I bought another one of these because I bought brought my other one to a party, a Christmas tree burning party, and then I left it there. So that was that. And then I found these candles. So I actually got two of these. And I wasn't going to buy any candles today, I don't know why, but these smelled in two of these. So one's pink, light pink, and one's blue. So I'll look at the blue one first. The blue one is ice cream sprinkles. And I smelt this at the store, and I, mmm, honestly, you know when you open up a vanilla frosting? and you smell that first smell, sniff that jar when you open it up, the plastic lid. This is exactly what it smells like. And that's an, a lot of wax in there. And you know how you tell a good candle from a bad burning candle? Most of the time, not always, but you feel the top, and if the wax is smooth, my girlfriend's up candle maker. She said if the wax is smooth, then that's a good wax. That's an even burning candle and it won't um, like puff black smoke. Mm, I'm going to burn this right when I'm done. And this one was equally amazing. Oh my gosh. I bought the last two. This is called Sweet Peach and it's right on. I mean, I know it's pink, but it smells so nice. And aren't these pretty? I like to have two on either side if I'm putting it on my like snack bar or my table, dining room table, I like to have set two. So that's why I buy two. I'm glad they had two. If they only had one of each, I still would have bought them because I really love the scent and it's pretty. So here's the difference. I think there's a little more wax in here. I'm not sure. And that's cute. Do you see that little, can you see it? And then this is cute too. This would be good in a gift basket. Yeah. So I highly recommend those if you guys see those in the, I haven't seen them before. You can comment down below if they're old or, but I, I have never seen those. So now, Okay, now we're on the Miami beach. Yep, we're on the beach. Look what I found. 
Aren't these gonna be great for traveling and on the beach and you can see it, your sunscreen, my, everything I bought, but I like the blue. That's pretty. And then this is kind of an iridescent silver, but it's iridescent. Can you guys see that? Aren't these adorable? I was so excited about these. So I'll put like, I don't know, my lip balm, my sunscreen, sunglasses, maybe my scrunchie, and then I'll put, you know, extra makeup. And I'll show you guys what I'll put in there. I bought some stuff to go in there for the beach. Oh, but first, look at this. Can you see that? So I could use this actually when I'm recording my videos. It's a telephone holder. It holds up your phone. And this is pink and purple. They had other colors, but I just, I thought this was cute. They had blue. Isn't that cool? For a dollar. Okay. And I bought just this universal black, it looks like snake skin scrunchie. I thought that was cute. Because that matches with something else. I bought some clothes. I'll show you guys that tomorrow. And let's see. I found this lip gloss. It's called Beauty Benefits. And I don't know if some of you, you know that I worked professionally as a makeup artist and I worked in department stores, high-end department stores, and they had the line Benefit there. I think they're trying to copy Benefit. If you shop at Ulta or Sephora, you know what I'm talking about, or Macy's or, let's see, I'm gonna try this on for you guys. So here's what it looks like. I don't have much lipstick on right now, so let's see. But I think, yeah, that's a nice color. Wow, that's a lot of color. Pretty, it's bright. But it, I think it'll look better when I get tan. I'm not tan right now at all. But I like the size. So that'll fit nicely in this little bag. Let's put it in there. I can't believe these are only a dollar. They have little pockets. Oh, look it. It has little outside pockets too. So these pockets are on the outside. So that's good. That's nice to keep like your phone in. Yeah. I'm glad I found those. Normally they don't have stuff like that. And then because we're gonna be in Miami for seven days, we needed some Carmex uh, SPF 15, which that's pretty good. Normally lip balm with an SPF is expensive, but the Carmex, so there's three of them. So I got one. one for my husband, one for myself, and one just in case. Cause we'll need a lot of that, our lips. My, my lips burn every time they're in the sun. And then, to put in this for the beach, I found this mirror. Cause you know when you have to go like, well there's Margaritaville right on Miami Beach, Hollywood Beach. And I have to make sure I look decent to go in there. So then I found this. Look at that. It's a collagen lip mask. It says, Hydrogel Lip Mask Anti-Wrinkle Serum. Helps to firm, tone, revive skin elasticity. 15 minute lip therapy. You guys have to try that. I think that is great. So instead of getting injections in your lips, just use this, try it. I'm gonna try it. I'll let you guys know. So it's the shape of a lip. I'm gonna do that tonight. Isn't that fun? I love doing fun little things like that. And then I bought one of these. I gave my daughter one, so I bought one for myself. It's a makeup remover, and you don't need any soap. 
So I'm gonna try, no soap needed, makeup vanishing towel. I can't wait to try that. So it's, I wonder if it'll take off mascara and everything. I'll let you know. I don't use soap anyway, I use baby wipes. Okay, so then I got my husband some of these glasses. I'm not sure, he's pretty blind when it comes, to, he likes to look on Craigslist. So it's the 250, it's just black. I thought for the airplane he could do a crossword puzzle or something. Yeah. I think it's a three hour flight. From, we'll fly out of Minneapolis, but I think it's a three hour flight. And then I did buy a backpack, a cooler backpack, it hasn't came yet. When I get the Amazon haul um, for the beach, I'll show you guys, but I bought this at the Dollar Tree to go inside the cooler, maybe the ice and stuff and the beer or whatever. So I bought that for that. And then I bought these. Aren't these cute? They're kind of cat-eyed. I like those. And we're not done. So these are all new. I've never seen these sunglasses before. And these. I thought those were really fun. And I like how big they are. Then it'll cover, it'll protect my eyes. All the way down here. Comment and tell me what ones you guys like best. Not done. I couldn't believe they have the big sunglasses. And these. I had a pair of these, but I left them um, in my brother's convertible when we went to Vegas, and I never got them back. But I like the big. Normally, Dollar Tree only has little, but these are the big. And then last but not least, these are really fun. Can you stand it? Look. The cat eye. Do you guys like those? Would you wear those? I don't care, I'm gonna wear them. Aren't those cute and fun? And then I'll have a straw rimmed hat with a black dress on, sleeveless, or cover up or whatever. Yeah. So what do you think? And what glasses do you like the best? Do you like the white round ones? The leopard? Kind of cat eye round, but the pointy, or the big black ones, or these, the cat eye. Let me know. Okay, you guys, that's it. I hope you liked it. Um, I can't wait to go to the beach. It's snowing out right now. It's like 20 below zero. I'm excited. I might have a drink with that. Mmm. Belvedere vodka. It's the best. And I don't drink a lot at all, but I think I'm going to. Okay, you guys. Thanks for watching. Bye. I missed one thing. The cat was laying on it. I want to show you guys this. Have you guys seen these duo nail polishes? So one's peachy. Can you see that? And one's green sparkles. I bought it for this color. I thought that would be pretty on the beach. Anyway, let me know if you've seen these or are these new. The brand is Julie. Julie. Distributed by CRL Marketing Oxford Huh, Julie, who knew? Okay, I didn't wanna leave that out. See you guys later, bye.